had to work for a day and a half. Everything after that was just uh, savings. But I have a train that was heavily logged. It's growing on either side of the train right now. There's the white fur. It's got the palish colored bark with these small neon green needles going right on the branch of the tree. If you're looking at these trees thinking they make an excellent Christmas mark correct, these are the most commercially farmed trees in the western half of the United States for Christmas trees. As a matter of fact, if you guys live in California and you purchase a live Christmas tree, it's like a white bird. You might have had one in your own home. The other tree is growing on the left-hand side of the train up on the center of the curve there. If you look up there, you'll see some trees with a reddish coloration to their bark. A lot of people think that these trees are some kind of redwood or baby giant sequoias, but these are actually incense cedar. They get that reddish uh, coloration from a chemical called tannin that will react with sunlight.